Library presents Ordinary People Change the World. I am Helen Keller by Brad Meltzer. Illustrated by Christopher Eliopoulos. Read for you by Saskia Marleveld and an ensemble cast. I am Helen Keller. When I was little, I was just like you. I loved to play, I loved my dog, and I loved seeing all the bright, beautiful flowers. I also loved copying people. At six months old, I could already say, Howdy! Howdy yourself! Tea, tea, tea! Did she just ask for tea? How'd she do that? What can I say? There's no stopping her. On the day I turned one, I started walking. Oh, and there was another word I always loved. Wawa! Here's your water. Just like any other kid, right? But there's one thing that made me different. When I was 19 months old, I got very sick. The doctors said I wouldn't live. I did live, but the sickness made me blind and deaf. This is how I see the world. Close your eyes and block your ears. I couldn't see anything or hear anything. That's right. Nothing. I know it seems scary. It was scary for me, too. Back then, people didn't know how to deal with someone who was deaf and blind. My relatives thought I was a monster. Wah, 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 wah! You see the way she behaves. She put her hand in my plate. She ate my food. She's trying to find her water. She threw the silverware, too. She's so poorly behaved. She shouldn't be here. They were right. I wasn't well behaved. I was extremely frustrated. In my dark world, I couldn't tell if anyone noticed me or cared about me. I couldn't see or hear what I was doing. But by the time I was five, I'd figured out small ways to communicate. To say yes... I nodded my head. For no, I shook it from side to side. To say father, I motioned to put on his glasses. For mother, I rested my hand on my face. Sample complete. Ready to continue?